Hello and welcome to Hardware Husky. Today we'll be looking at the Patriot Viper Gaming Viper Steel Series 3216GB kit CL16. Kit consists of two 8 gig sticks. Box is very nice at the same time. Little information around the box. Let's get this open. See what's inside. Inside we have two sticks of RAM and a Viper gaming sticker. Open and have a look at the RAM itself. Let's get us out. Come on, there we go. Was one and two. The weight of these sticks is quite light compared to what they look like. Probably due to the top bar being plastic it looks like. But it's nice. Minimalistic and so are some people there's no RGB so might be perfect. Be warned though these are still quite tall so if you've got a large air cooler double check before you buy now there's not really much I can show you about this RAM and make this video longer but let's have a look at some quick and dirty overclocks tightening up the timings I managed to get 15 15 15 35 which is not bad for a quick play with the timing definitely get more if I spent a bit more time and let's look at frequency overclocking we managed to get 3600 megahertz at 18, 19, 90, 39. So quite a respectable overclock from a 3200 kit. The Patriot Viper Steel series appears to be a good buy. It looks nice in my opinion. Doesn't have RGB so it might suit other people. The price is reasonable and it overclocked fairly well in my case. I would definitely recommend this if you're looking for non-RGB RAM on a tighter budget, 100%. And that's it for this video. I do apologize if I've made a load of weird errors as I have a new baby and I am sleep deprived. Please like and subscribe and I hope I'll see you again.